What's up, YouTube? All right, so the big question is, Loyal Doyle, why did you spend another $16,000 on Upland today uh, to buy virtual properties in the metaverse? Well, let me explain. Uh, today, if you didn't know, the city of Nashville was... It had previously been released, but today they announced the collections. And collections in Upland are essentially like Monopoly, groups of properties that if you put them together, uh, you can get in additional, you can earn additional money. Kind of like a Monopoly if you put a hotel or a house on your property and you get more rent out of those properties, right? So these are all the collections that were released in Nashville. And the boost, you could see here, the boost that they all pay out. So Upland plays a pays out a flat rent fee or interest fee, if you will, 17% of the mint price, meaning the price that it was purchased originally from the game, not the price that players resell it to other players for, but the original mint price, they pay 17% interest on that plus the boost from the collection. If you fill that boost, and if you look here, the boosted collection of the biggest one in Nashville is 46% interest, 46.41% interest. And those are the properties that I bought today. So let me show you. It's on this little road called Jackson Boulevard in Nashville, Tennessee. Uh, I bought these two big ones right here, okay? Um, the first one was six million Upix or six thousand eight hundred and twenty-five dollars, and the second one was seven million Upix or seven thousand and fifteen U.S. dollars. But check this out: this property alone is going to pay me two hundred and seventy-five thousand Upix or two hundred and seventy-five USD every month. Uh, and the other one is going to pay me 268,000 or 268 pretty much 269 dollars a month USD. That is okay. This is the strategy to really get ahead in Upland. Not that you have to spend this much money, but buy mint. The goal is to mint properties in collections that pay out high yield, high interest, high rent, whatever you want to call it. Uh, th this is the goal. There's still some properties now. They are very expensive. There's still some that have not been minted on Jackson Boulevard. As of the time of recording this video, this one is 21 million Upix or $21,000. But guess what? This one will pay you $851 a month. There's another big one up the road here at the very end of the road. I think it's the biggest one. 17 million Upix. No, the last one was bi was bigger. This one pays you $694 a month. $695 essentially when you convert it back to USD. So, but to get to realize that value, you have to let's see, let's go to Nashville collections. You have to fill the collection. So just like Monopoly, you have to have all the cards same way in Upland, you, I have to have all three. If I just have one, it's not going to pay me the 2.73 boost. I have to have all three, and you can see it says that it's active. Okay? So all three of those, and that made it active, and now boom, that's the money that I'm earning. So you can see, if you start to make strategic investments in Upland, you can start to make money really quick. If I go to the Properties button, I can sh it will show you Look how much I'm now making per month. 2,482,000 Upix or two million five hundred dollars or two thousand five hundred US dollars a month almost. That is why I'm so bullish on Upland. There's not many investments out there that are paying yield and interest like that. And you can reinvest that into the game and it has a snowball effect. So every time I buy a new property with the money that I'm earning here, it's just raising that value and I have a snowball effect going for me. Uh, fellas, get in on Upland. 
this, I mean, this is uh, this is the time to get in. We're still at the beginning. I hear a lot of people, a lot of new players coming in. Like, it's too late. I'm like, all the big wells, all the people that have a bunch of money. Like, they're they're no one's gonna be able to catch up to them. No, the reason I grew so fast in Upland is because I'm investing money. I've put in. After the 16,000 I invested today and I invested about 25,000 previously, I've invested about $40,000 into the game because I believe I can make a return on that investment. So please leave a comment if you have any questions, share this video with your friends and uh, thanks for watching. See you in the next one.